how's it going guys it's me orange here back with another video for you guys and today we will be doing another scripting tutorial hopefully you guys are seeing the differences from my past videos to my um recent ones and the quality improvements and such um such as uh the less background noise and stuff like that hopefully you guys are just noticing that because i'm trying my best to uh, go ahead and um improve the quality of the videos so um today what we're going to do is something requested and this is going to be a dashing script now people really want to do such things such as tap w twice tap a twice and dash um and we're going to do just that now but um today we're going to um only do um w so that you guys go forward um i am getting pings all right all right um so today i'm going to be doing a um only a double w dash so that you guys can somewhat figure out the rest because um one script is always easier than um the other ones and if you guys didn't go ahead and check out my recent tutorial on how to make no uh, material noises uh where you step on stuff and it creates noises and yeah so first things first open up starter player go to starter character scripts press the plus button and press local script you can name the script dash if you would like but i'm not going to do that Next, you want to set up your variables. So in this case, we're gonna have a couple variables. The reason we need these two variables is because um, every local sh script should have it, especially the script since we're dashing, meaning that it has something to do with the character. Next, we want user input service. And finally, we need a couple settings. So, so tapped is false, so we haven't tapped yet. So the time is um, the amount of time you need to press W. Um, so basically I have to press W within 0.3 seconds. We can reduce that to 0.25 and that should be it. So now what we wanna do is this is actually really, really simple. User input service and we just do our normal input began. And there's going to be no debounce. If input.keycode equals keycode.w, so we're going forward, then if tapped, if not tapped, then tap equals true, wait, time and tap equals false else so basically how this script works is it detects input and it makes sure it's not anything with GUIs and then um, it moves on to check what input was inputted and it says if the input is W then um, if tapped is false, so if not tapped, tap is false, then you turn tap equals true and wait um, this amount of time and then tapped is false. Uh, you may be wondering why I do this, it's pointless, but actually, um, so if not tapped, then tapped is true. Else, meaning that if tapped is true, that means it has to go through this first. So this has to go through once, that's one W. And then this is two W's because you tapped it again. And if it's still true, it hasn't turned false yet. Um, has, hasn't turned false yet because it's still waiting. Um, then you can do your um, velocity changes. Now I'm not gonna add any special animations. This is just gonna be a quick tutorial. So let's go ahead and do this. Humanoid root part dot velocity
So basically this changes the velocity meaning that it's going to take the character up forward or so and this is probably the most simplest way to move a character you could use a body velocity which probably would have been better as well but for the sake of this tutorial let's go ahead and check it out so as you can see I double tap W and I dash an incredible distance And if you add an animation, it would look much better. Now, how do I decrease the power? Go ahead and decrease this number. How do I increase the power? Go ahead and increase this number. So, thank you guys for watching. This is a really simple way to de um, detect double tap during a certain amount of time. Hopefully, you guys have use for this, enjoyed it, because I'm going to be using this in my own game. And if you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Go ahead and comment down below on what tutorials you guys want next. And I'll make sure to um, slightly go over them so that you can be able to make your own games. Thank you guys for um, joining me today. Um, I am Orange, and join my Discord servers if you want to talk to me in person. And I'll see you guys next time. You don't own my mama